All right, everybody. Well, we got our news earlier that the Big Ten is coming back in October, late October. And now we got some news out of the Pac-12. Oh, boy, let me tell you. It is an honor to say that schools are allowed to play in these, in these affected areas, you know, where COVID has become a hot spot for Pac-12 country to say the least. Um, now, I don't know if Pac-12 has a real plan yet, but Larry Scott has come out and said, along with um, the Mountain West, they've come out and said some things, you know, where it's like, okay, we're getting a little bit closer to play, but it's not, it's not ready yet. Speaking of play, uh, the FCS is moving forward with their plan to go in the spring, um, which is the dumbest idea because it really impacts the athletes that are there that are just now getting there, the freshmen and sophomores especially, because they aren't eligible to get drafted yet. And if they do get drafted anyway, because there there are some players in the FCS level that do get drafted. But from late April to May, it will be a 16-team playoff, of course. Some teams will have, you know, have already scheduled some non-conference games for that time such as Jackson State which is scheduled a non-conference game with their conference opponent because that's just how the SWAC does things that's how pretty much pretty much any FCS conference that doesn't have their stuff together like the SWAC you know they do that just to you know keep the rivalries and stuff safe and everything like that but um yeah so April 18th is the start date for the FCS playoffs. I will probably not be watching. Probably watch just the championship, to be completely honest with you. But um, if, it does, if it does continue to go on this trajectory, it's the spring. And lastly here, the NCAA has announced the pretty much the start date of college basketball. I usually do not cover college basketball so early. I usually start in January with my coverage of college basketball because that's when everything, you know, gets crazy around these parts with, you know, football season winding down and basketball season coming up and then, you know, indoor football as well coming up. But, you know, at the same time, I think this is a great starting point November 25th. You know, it'll be right before Thanksgiving. It, it gives teams enough time. Now, there's been some talk of bowls and stuff like that for the tournament since we can't really host things, different sites and stuff like that. But we'll just have to wait and see because basketball season is still a long time away and everything like that. So that's pretty much it. That's all I got to say. Um, honestly, you know, Pac-12 either should return or just not even play this year. If they're still trying this mid-November thing, then it's, okay. then it's okay. Just let it go. Just let it go. The season's pretty much gone by then. And as far as game cancellations go, there really hasn't been any news to that. There's been some games added, of course. I'm talking about college football, by the way. But there's been some stuff that's been added, stuff that really hasn't been canceled, stuff that have gotten TV times confirmed and everything like that. But what we do know, what we do think is set in stone is that the Big Ten is coming back. Pac-12 thinking about it. Mountain West thinking about it. Um, as far as the Mid-American, you know, hashtag Maction, as we all like to affectionately call it. They're not coming back this year. They'll probably, you know, wait it out and come on back next year if things go the way they are going. You know, we're getting a little bit closer to getting something with the, you know, the, the virus and the vaccine and stuff like that. But it's still going to take a while. Of course, you know, you got to have testing and stuff like that. So, who knows? So, with that being said, everybody, um, this is probably going to be the last video of the week, maybe. It just depends on what in the world happens. But I will see you guys either sometime later in the week or on Sunday, probably. Either Saturday night or Sunday, probably Sunday. Um, so, yeah, big boy variety out, and I'll see you next time. Peace.